On March 14, 2018, North students participated in a walkout to honor the lives lost in the school shooting at Stoneman Douglas High School in Parkland, Florida. At 10 a.m., students left in the middle of the third period classes and met on Carson's Field. Cool, so why did you guys participate today? I think it's important that our uh, message is seen. Like, I don't know, I feel like it's important that our government can see that like we're trying to make a difference, we're trying to show that we all care, that this is an issue that affects all of us. Yes. Once there, the scoreboard was set to 17 minutes, one minute for each student killed in the Stoneman shooting. Every minute, student organizers read off a name of a victim followed by a short eulogy. The crowd then responded with a moment of silence for each victim. Aaron Feist died from a bullet wound soon after being rushed to surgery. The spokeswoman of the Douglas football program said, he died the same way he lived. He put himself second. Please join me in a moment of silence for Aaron. After 17 minutes, students released orange balloons into the air in honor of the victims of gun violence. According to the DGN Walkout Twitter page, 564 students participated in the walkout, roughly 26% of the student body. Some students chose to make signs to bring out to the walkout. And TJ, you have a sign today, right? Yes, I do. What, why did you want to make a sign? I wanted to make a sign because I'm just so ready for this to be over. There's just been so many killings even just in 2017. While students were not allowed to leave school grounds, a group of community parents and adults lined up on the sidewalk across from the school to express their support. Once back in the building, students were asked to swipe their ID and received an unexcused absence pass back to the third period class. From the Downers Grove North Omega, I'm Isabel LaBianco.